Today is Valentine's Day, but I don't care because it's a corporate holiday and I feel like it's just gotten just all about money and stuff. Like if you care about somebody, don't just wait on a day to buy them fucking something um, stupid. Like Jeremy got me those flowers the other day. My makeup is bad because I just woke up. But it means more when somebody gets you something not on a day like Valentine's Day. To me and to everybody, like my sister, her man, me and my man, we just don't do anything because it's it's like kind of expected and we don't like that. We like surprises and stuff because it seems more genuine and if you love someone you don't necessarily need to do it on Valentine's Day. But we really aren't into a lot of um, holidays except for like Christmas, but we're not really religious with it like that. We just get presents I guess. We used to be religious, we used to grow up in the church back in the day, but don't. But today is Valentine's Day and I don't care, it's just a regular day to me. But this vlog today is going to be really short because I'm not going to be doing anything today except I might get some drawing footage in because I haven't drawn in a few days trying to upload and learn um, all the programs for editing um, my film, not my film, my vlogs. <laughs> but yeah, so um, I'll try to get more drawing stuff in. It's just me trying to figure out everything with um, editing and stuff like that. It's just time consuming. It takes a lot of hours to edit and stuff when you have a lot of footage and put it together and stuff, which is fun. We're getting the hang of it and getting better at it. Um, so hopefully, I'll, I'm not still sure if we're doing daily vlogs. I might just do a vlog maybe three times a week or four times a week. Um, I'm not sure what you guys recommend, but because my life is exciting sometimes, but not all the time. I mean, I'm just at home mostly doing art and stuff, but I'll film that. And I will probably film more food cooking of me cooking food. Yesterday I didn't have all the ingredients and that's why I didn't show like me cooking all the way through just the aftermath and the beginning. But makeup all over my face. I look like a raccoon, but that's okay. I'm just at home. Um, but yeah, I'll see you guys later. Maybe I'll do another drawing time lapse or a partial of one. I don't know really what to draw right now. But I'm about to get inspired, if you know what I mean. And I'm going to draw something later. First, I think I might relax and play Resident Evil because I've been doing that. Jeremy's getting ready for work. And he's being weird. I'm just kidding. He's always acting weird. That's just him. That's just his natural behavior. We're just weird people. We're different. We're crazy. We're crazy, sexy, cool. You're probably about to leave real soon, huh, for work? Hmm? Yeah, yeah, he's leaving for work. He has to work soon. So I will be home, not 100%. Sashi's man's here, but they're leaving, and oh, I was gonna cook. I got so you found the man's pen? He found, did he come in and ask for it? Oh, you just want to give it back to him when you get a chance? He said to give it back, and I had your kid, uh, man of my word. Man of his word, he says he's man of his word. I am about to cook dinner. It's going to be um, turkey cabbage rolls with turkey instead of the ground beef because you guys all know if you've already been watching, I don't do um, beef or pork or anything like that besides like birds and fish or whatever. But I'm going to be using this extra olive oil in there for whatever the recipe calls for, the ground turkey. Um, some of these. I'm going to chop them up and put them on the outside with the with the sauce. And I'm going to be peeling the leaves off of the um, cabbage. And then I'm going to boil those. And I already have my onions pre-cut. And then I'm going to, um, along with the rice, stuff the, in the inside fresh zucchini. And make it a little bit different. I saw that some people use um, carrots, but I plan to use that instead. I have carrots, but I don't want to use those. I need to use these up before I accidentally make them, let them go to waste. And I don't want to do that because I really like zucchini and it makes me sad when I let things go to waste on accident. And I'm also getting the dishes done right now, but I'll show you what it all looks like in a few. And I got to charge my camera because it's at 3%. So let me charge that and I'll get back to you guys. Here I have, um, for the cabbage rolls, I have the ground turkey, the rice, um, the sliced up 
onions and sliced up uh, zucchini with some seasonings, a little bit of salt. I put a little Italian seasoning just to give it some, just very little to give a little flavor. Um, I used a little bit of Johnny's as usual and I used a little bit of pepper. I don't know if I already said that. Pepper. And then I um, got the cabbage and I peeled all the leaves off and I'm there's my egg. I'm waiting to do my egg to mix until these are actually ready to put in the oven after they're already boiled and um, cooled. And then I'll do that. And I have my water. It's not quite done yet. But that's all I'm doing right now. It is Valentine's Day. Like I said, it, we don't do anything for Valentine's Day. It's a regular day to us because um, we don't believe in that. If you love someone, you shouldn't have a day set by, like, not the government, but you you know what I mean. It just seems weird, but that's all I'm doing. It's just a regular day. I'm making cabbage rolls with tur turkey cabbage rolls, so I'm making with um, zucchini in the inside. So, yeah, you will see the end result. Now the cabbage, cabbage, <laughs> the cabbage is boiling for four minutes. And then after that, I'm going to rinse it with cold water, and then I'm going to, um, oh, I need to use tomato sauce. I think I have tomato sauce. Yes, I do have tomato sauce. For the inner portion of the um, cabbage rolls, I'm going to put mixed tomato sauce with this and egg. Um, and then on top, I'm going to pour the prego. It's kind of going to be like, in a way, kind of like tamales, but... It's cabbage and it doesn't have Mexican seasonings. Um, but yeah, if you've ever had cabbage rolls, you know what they're like. They're really fucking good and they're really filling and you don't have to eat that much to get full, like little pieces and you get full. Um, the first time I had cabbage rolls, I went to Bruno's with Jeremy. Um, it was a really good restaurant and at that time I um, used to eat pork and all those types of things and um, it was really good and I liked it so I wanted to do it with my own spin um, because I don't do those meats. So that's what I did and this is a steaming super hard so let me turn that, oops, turn that down so I will show you the next step. The cabbage is all done now, um, so I'm here now going to stuff them. So just grab these and then put them on and then roll them. And I actually didn't have any tomato paste, so I just used this. I was only gonna, planning on using that for the top, but uh, I have to use what I have. But it should turn out good. And I'm actually just going to put some. Um, I put some on the bottom and I'm with a little olive oil so it doesn't stick or anything to the pan. And I'm probably going to cook the rest of this um, in the oven, the cabbage rolls, for probably an hour, maybe? I haven't decided yet. It depends on how um, I want them. But I might do it for an hour, maybe less. I might add cheese, too. I'm not sure. Maybe that could be something for afterwards. But I'll show you the finished product. So these are just about ready to put into the oven. Um, that's what the cabbage rolls look like. I actually just added the rest of what was left over on the top and I'm just going to pour more sauce on top and then pop it in the oven and I still don't know if I'm going to put cheese. Probably not. This is the finished product. It's all done and I'm about to take it out of the oven. Dun, da, da, da. Here it is. I added cheese as you can tell. Oh, added cheese as you can tell. Um, just a little, not too much. I mean, it's a lot, but there's a lot in here. This is for everybody who wants to eat. So, that is that. I think we are going to go to bed. And I had a lot of, um, but I got took up by editing yesterday's vlog. Um, but I plan to draw, uh, tomorrow's, well, whatever day it is, the next day after, draw more so that I can get that in there. I had my cam set up and everything. But unfortunately, um, editing took up most of my time today. But I'm getting to know the program better, so it'll be easier with better smoothness and all that good stuff. But we're going to eat dinner. It's really late because Jeremy got off 
um, work late, so I wait for him to eat dinner. And then we're probably going to watch a movie, go to bed, and then tomorrow will probably be more exciting since Jeremy's day off is tomorrow. And uh, I have a few things I need to do. Um, I actually want to get my nose pierced. And I was thinking about doing my um, philthrum right here pierced. If you didn't know this about me, you know now that I love body modification along with art. It To me, it is a form of art um, and a way to express myself. Um, it's very sacred to me and I want each piercing that I ever get to be in um, a spiritual experience for me. Like I do have my septum pierced but I actually have it tucked up um, most of the time right now because I don't have good jewelry right now. I just have um, a horseshoe or whatever you'd like to call it um, and the balls are missing and I just keep it up there because I can't find any good quality jewelry in um, in my area that sells any, um, I might have to drive far to get some good stuff because I want to put good things in my body that aren't going to um, make me have an allergic reaction or that are going to tarnish or rust because that's not good for you and it's not good to um, expose your body to those things so I'm looking for a piercer, um, yeah. So I think I'm going to end the vlog with that and I'll say good night to you guys and it is Valentine's Day even though I don't celebrate I will say happy Valentine's Day. Um, and have a great night, great day, whatever it is, God bless. So today is Monday, and Jeremy has the day off today. I just got done cleaning the kitchen. Do -do 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 -do. Kitchen's clean. That's clean. And so we're going to be doing some errands today. Um, Jeremy, I got him some socks for Christmas through Amazon, but they never ever came. So I'm going to buy him some socks today. And I'm going to get him some undershirts for his work. Because he needs undershirts. And I think I might get myself an outfit or something. Because I haven't been shopping in a while. And I have a little money and I need clothes. Because I don't have a lot of clothes. I mostly have summertime clothes like this tank top. I mean, summer's almost here again. So I'm sure spring and... Um, clothings are in right now too so we'll probably go to Burlington or Target or Walmart or something like that today on this fine Monday um, yeah so I'll see you guys in a bit and we will be heading out and going all over the place today hopefully